Hey, parents, I hope you guys are having a great week. And uh, man, I know I look a little bit different, um, but that's why DIY videos don't always go right. And you can always go back to a buzz cut, right? And so, uh, man, uh, crazy times that we are in where you're having to cut your own hair again. And uh, all my love goes out to my barber because you did amazing work and now I butchered it all. But uh, wow, I want to talk to you guys about uh, a little bit something that uh, I've been reflecting a little bit more on as a parent. Uh, a lot of times, uh, parenting is all about sacrifice. Man, you give up so much for your kids. And uh, man, I'm sure your parents gave up a lot for you. We give up time, we give up uh, a lot of energy. But man, how important is it to have some self-care? That's what I want to talk to you guys today about is you need to have a self-care routine in your life. One that is for your spiritual health, your emotional health, and your physical health. So my challenge to you is what are you doing to take care of yourself before you take care of your kids? And I know it sounds a little bit backwards intuitive. We got to take care of our kids. We got to love our kids. But man, think about uh, when you're on an airplane, when they're walking through those instructions, when they tell you that mask drops down, what do you do first? You put on your own mask first before you help your kids. Because if you aren't healthy, if you're not spiritually healthy, if you're not emotionally healthy, if you're not physically healthy, you cannot help your kids. So my challenge to you today is, man, what do you need to do to get healthy again? What self-care do you need to add? Do you need to spend more time in God's word? Do you need just a moment in the morning just to breathe for a little bit before the chaos unfolds? Do you need to start working out, getting physical, changing your diet, so that way you are gonna be there for the long run for your kids? Man, today, feel the freedom to take care of yourself first. We have amazing resources that are in place just for that. If you go to our website, evergreenpnw.com slash kidsonline, we have stuff, not just for your kids. We have stuff for your kids, um, but we have stuff for there for you as well. We have links to some amazing books, some podcasts, and some blogs that are going on. And they're all about helping you, the parent, as you grow in your walk with God. So that way you can, in turn, demonstrate, live it out, and show your kids what it's like to be a fully devoted follower of Christ. So my challenge to you today is pick one thing. Pick either a spiritual discipline, a emotional discipline, or a physical discipline to help you get healthier today.